Oh. I don't know, I forgot to hit the record button. So the Osprey actually flew off all the way to the end, like all the way past those trees and everything. So unfortunately I wasn't able to watch the Osprey roost. Yeah, I mean, the problem is that I discovered that the Osprey's mate is very, very territorial and just won't allow you to get close. It's just impossible. But the male, the male seems to allow it. Yeah, which is weird because normally when the female is nesting, she'll allow you to get right at the nest, but she'll make territorial calls when she's in the nest. But she'll still stay there and everything. Yeah, so... Well, now that the Osprey are gone, I mean... Wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me see if I saw them. Did I see them? No, they're not even at this lake anymore. Yeah, they really hid from us from, for good this time. Aww. Yeah, I'm so disappointed. Yeah, so I think it was the male Osprey that actually flew elsewhere. Then, and then the female followed him. Uh, just a major disappointment in my opinion. I always like it when the Osprey just want to sleep right there. Right you above still got you. to see them at least, you know? Yeah, at least I got to see them. Yeah, that is the most important part. At least I got to see them, right. Yeah, positive mental attitude. Positive mental attitude. You're right, okay. Don't worry about the negative. Uh, yeah, I know. I, I, just, I just like things to be perfect, that's all. Well, that's I life. know not every day can be perfect, but that's just the way it goes, Some you know? Some days feel like it, though, right? Yeah. All right, so before we go, let me just check one more thing. Uh-huh. Maybe we got a few minutes just to just check the skate park really quick. Oh, perfect. All right. All right, so the Osprey aren't here. And I'm not really going to look for them at this point. But they did fly, like, away from the trees. Osprey. Yeah, I don't see nothing. I don't see no osprey. Yeah, they really hit for me for good this time. What a shame. Oh. Yeah, and today's the last day before going to work. I mean, the osprey can't be too far off. I'm sure they're probably in those, in that thicket of trees somewhere, hiding from me. Or at least the female's hiding from me. I don't know about the male, though. But the female flew first, and then the male followed her. And the male just wants to go where she's going. So, because because the female's fearful, the male also has to be fearful, too. Because the male has to follow the female wherever she goes, so that they stay safe. As explained in the rest of the video. Alright, so I'm going to, into the car. I'm going to go skate park before I go home. There's not going to be anything there, but I'm going to go, um, I'm going to just go there. I'm not going to film anything now. Alright, I am out of here. I'll see you on Thursday, hopefully. If I don't oversleep because this whole cryptocurrency mine actually got hacked. I want to tell you about that. Let me get in the car here. What about this one? I got hacked. This one back here? Yeah. Oh crap. I got hacked. Um, on my Ethereum account because... I didn't secure my private key enough and I sent my email, my mom an email in plain text of my private key, which you should never do, ever. 
in the cryptocurrency world. You never email somebody your private key. That's like beyond stupid, okay? So you email your private key, you're only asking for trouble, all right? So that's basically what happens. And so I made security precautions, including creating a private key offline and storing it on a USB drive that's never touched the internet. It's hmm. basically what you have to do. So you can, you could actually, you, there's an algorithm that's used to generate a, a Eurythium address. The Eurythium address is technically already on the bit, or on the blockchain. It's just been encrypted. And basically what it does is it encrypts it and then it decrypts it again. So you don't need the internet to do that. And you can still get paid in Eurythium just by using an offline um, Eurythium generator. So it really works, and it's super, super secure. It's almost as secure as a hardware wallet. The only way the hacker would get in is if he, he looked at the USB contents, like once I connected online. But I would take the USB drive off my computer before that happens. All right, well, that's it. That's a wrap. I'm out of here.